I'm back. Unfortunately, you didn't even know I was gone. I did a whole video on this repair, which I will try to point out things here. I welded in a patch from here to here to here to here. They originally had a patch, which I have joined right here with. No, right here. And if you follow this outline here, that's where they've laid a patch in. And they just laid it in. See right here? They brazed it. I hope you can see that, get enough light on it. They brazed it in. Wasn't welded in. So water got behind it, it rusted. That's what all this is about. But I had just two little rust holes right here and here. So I took the metal that I cut out of here and this is what's left of it. It, uh, it went something like that, except for it was Okay, there. That's how it was. Right there, and they brazed that in. There was no problem with metal up here. Not really a problem down here. There is was after. This stuff set on there, and you can see the rust on this too. But either way, I pulled the memory card, plugged it into my computer, and card's corrupt. There's three layers of patches. This one was welded in. This one was brazed in. Now this is all welded and put back. I've got to try to bring this metal back out where it belongs. But there's two layers of metal in here where they've laid in a patch behind here. So there's a patch behind. Then the metal was cut out. Then this patch was put in. I guess the metal was too high, so they beat it in. So I've got to try to straighten all that out yet. You can see there's a... I hope you can see. There is four layers of Bondo. That's one, two, three, four... Actually, it's five. But one layer is fiberglass. You can see it right there, fiberglass. Either way, this is what I've got left to fix. I'm not going to try to do this. That's just getting into way more work than what I wanted for this old truck. I'm just trying to make it look a little bit better. And this all came about because there was a crack right in here from the Bondo separating because of the rust getting in behind here pushing the metal out so you missed all that one and it didn't turn out too bad like I say once I push or pull whatever however I bring this back out and then smooth it out and bond over it but I mean that's a lot of bondo down there I mean, you can see it it's that's a little much I will do what I can I'm not a body man but hey I'm a mechanic learning Bondo body. And then the next project will be this. Oh, wind's blowing. That was my door. I think I'm going to just gotta cut a piece out here. That looks like that's all rotted out. I'll buff, I'll clean off the rest of the Bondo on down and see just how bad all this is. And clean that out and I'll probably add it to this video all right aren't you happy have a good day bye and it is time to get in here and start buffing taking out more Bondo I'm gonna guess down around and probably up into there somewhere so we're going to see how it goes. I will be right back.
Okay, let me try this again. See if you can see the wave going down the side. And coming down through here. Basically, all I'm going to do here is I'm going to go up underneath, come in from behind, and just shove this out. I've decided it is not worth my time and trouble. You know, somebody else, later down the road, when I get rid of this thing, wants to go to all the work to try to fix all this. Their best bet is going to be replace the whole quarter panel. That would be my way of doing it at this point in time. There's just too much rust here, there, and the other place. And it's been repaired over so many times. I don't know how far that piece of metal goes up. It may go clear across, clear up to the front. I have no idea. And I'm not going to find out. I'm just going to quit where I'm at, fix those two holes, which they seem to have just bonded over. Press this out. And bondo back over it again. Smooth it out. I make my best attempt at it. As I said, this is not my forte. Alright, you guys have a good day. And I will bring you back when we get a little further along. Well, here's where I'm at. And it ain't pretty. Some of the welds still stand up a little bit. But, for the amount of Bondo that's going to be put back over the top of this, I am just not going to worry. I thought I just had a small little repair to make, which has turned into this disaster. of Three, possibly even four layers of patches put on this truck. <coughs> so... Short of replacing the whole quarter panel, which I am not going to do. This is just going to be a hunting and fishing and get out and have fun with truck. This is not supposed to be a show truck. Although I seem to have a bad habit of I start something and then I just keep going and going just like this. It was a little crack. I could have just forgotten about it and not worried about it. But no, I had to try to do something with it, and this is what I got into. So, we're going to call this good. Probably the next time you'll see this, it'll be bondoed and painted and done. Okay, I'm back out here. You can see all of what I did. They just laid in metal all the way across, clear back here. I took it out, welded in part of it and back here is where I've been working it and finally just said enough I mean you can see there's a dent back there there's some high spots low spots where they've gone in did work just laid metal over the top and brazed it in and stuff and now That didn't turn out too bad, considering how bad it was to begin with. And that too started out as just a bubble spot. Actually a crack in the paint that I decided to try to figure out what it was. Now I wish I'd have left it alone. This is my new spot. You can see exactly what I'm talking about. They just laid a piece of metal in here right over the top of the rust down here there's a piece here there's a piece here I mean this thing's been patched over a few times 
So I'm going to come in, cut clear across. I'm going to sand on down. I may go all the way down to here. Come over over here. I'm all the way up, all the way over, and in. And just replace that whole section instead of jacking around with it like they did. I mean, you can see more here. This is, I don't know what that is other than a mess. And I'm not even going to get into that one. The only reason I got into this one was because it was the rust was bubbling up underneath all this Bondo. So, that's a new project. Like, share, subscribe, enjoy. Watch my misery.